Hello everyone, I'm Hooligan Husky and welcome back to Okami. Last time, we came here to the Dragon Palace and we learned that to get to Oni Island, we need to go inside the water dragon and retrieve the dragon orb. Then we can get to Oni Island. So, and uh, he's apparently rest hanging out in the dragon garden. Uh, you've got a shell amulet? Uh, forget my rudeness. Uh, you were never rude though. <laughs> I never talked to you, and you were never rude to me, so you saying sorry for being rude was kind of pointless. This is not the Dragon Garden, but I wanted to come in here because there's some treasure and also a clover where we can get some praise. It's a big clover. We're not... We have not been shrieked, so... Bullhorn! What a load of bullhorn, am I right? Um, my, yeah. mm, there's something up there. Uh, what's that? Nothing? Okay, well, I forgot how to get up there. I think it's just a stray beat anyway. Actually, I have no idea. I do not remember. Ahem. <clears throat> well, if we go over here, spring up, spring, Lulu. Spring up, spring, Lulu. Is it just me or are the others singing something different? That water dragon is causing havoc now that it's settled in the palace. It snores so loud and every time it stirs there's an earthquake. I don't know if that's why but our swirly whirly springs dried up. Us dance troop girls have been ordered to do a water dance. But this dance wouldn't get, wouldn't get any spring flowing again. No, I say we need to smash through the rock under the spring. If we hit water, that would get the spring going again. If only someone would help and dig a hole where the spring was. Some seriously hard rock. But you could dig through if you practice enough. Okay. Well, bye! <laughs> yeah. I I want to say there's a brush technique we can get from doing that, but we can't right now anyway because we can't even dig through that, so we're just not going to do that. Uh, yes, and you as well were never even rude to me at all, so you don't need to <laughs> apologize. Ami, doesn't it seem like we've been meeting lots of girls lately? I mean, how long has it been since we ran into a guy? I only have hope they don't take advantage of me. <laughs> hey, soon. You're unbelievable. <sighs> oh. The music has gotten all echoey and distant. Well, um. Before we continue on to our possible demise. Uh. I heard a noise. How convenient. Hmm? What the? It's that pesky water dragon. How many times did that rampaging, rampaging sea monster almost finish us off? Once. <laughs> so it makes its home here, eh? That's one huge nasty looking mouth on that thing. I think we're really gonna go in there and come back out alive? I mean, we're not talking about the emperor's stomach here. True. I mean, what do we say? Leap before you think. But before we do that, I would like to collect some more treasure. There's one up here too! Don't <laughs> slide off the platform. Uh, stray bead, yeah, yeah. Let's see, is there anything else? I think that's all. Well, you know the drill. Leap before you think. Well, here we are. This is the water dragon's stomach, huh? Is it just me, or is it unbearably hot and humid in here? Hmm, with the only- with the way this dragon is running amok, I'm sure we'll see all sorts of gruesome things down here. I just hope I don't lose my lunch. Think we're really gonna find that dragon orb in here, Ami? I don't know, Isun, but who knew that the inside of a dragon would be so pretty and be playing 
such pretty music. <laughs> I mean, honestly, the music is really peaceful considering our situation. <laughs> yeah, Holy Bone S. I will always take those. I love Holy Bone S's. They save my my skin whenever I need them. Uh, oh, I guess I just slash it. Uh, come on. What? Oh. I want you, treasure. Oh. Or maybe it's just embedded in the dragon and we can't actually get it. Okay, then. Or we can get it and I'm just sudden, somehow failing horribly. Oh, well. Um. Just some slip. Alright. Yeah, I guess the wider dragon eats plenty of treasure, which I am now grateful for. Can I cut this down? Ew! Fluids are spilling out! That's gross! Oh, hello! Apparently it's eaten some enemies too? I mean, that's a good thing, right? Uh, I don't know. Let's just finish these guys. This guy's off real quick. Oh, you're defending yourself. But not for long! <laughs> oh, no! Uh, Power Slash probably is a floor finisher anyway. I'm pretty sure, like, no enemies at this point have a Power Slash as their floral finisher, but I still do it anyway. I don't know, I'm just weird like that. Okay, and we have won the battle! Give me my score! Oh, come on! Oh well, could have been worse. Can I cut these? Oh, they give you ink. Okay, let's just move on. Yeah, sometimes it's best if you just try not to think too hard about where you are and what you're looking at and standing on. Yeah. Um, a vengeance slip. Makes you invincible, kind of OP. I never use them personally because, well, I did when I collecting the straight beads, but that's for another time. Uh, I don't think there's anything down here, really. Let's see, let me use water sprout. Maybe, uh, I need a lily pet. Uh, I'm about to drown. Can I just, where am I? Oh, I'm going up the sprout. Okay. That's fine and dandy. Got some more treasure over here! No! I thought I could make that. Okay, well, let's go back over here. Yeah. It's very blue. I like the colors here. <laughs> That's one thing. Oh! Come on. I got one of these things. Wow. You are really easy. Your health is going down really quickly. That was very easy. <laughs> if I don't get a perfect score, I'm gonna slap someone. Uh, well, I don't have anyone to slap, so I guess I'll just slap myself. There! Yeesh! Okay, well, can I make it, please? Oh, yeah. That's Steel Soul Sake. Here we get. Steel Fist Sake! Soul Fist Steel. And if we go behind this waterfall, we find... Okay! Um, I would not like to discuss how long it took me to figure that out on my first playthrough. Let's just, um, not even go there. <laughs> uh, I don't know how I missed that, but yeah. I remember now. Uh, oh, my brush line was extremely thin, but it worked, so, so I can't really say anything at all. Up and up we go. I don't think we're... it leads to anything, though. I mean, it obviously leads to this, but no secrets. And I'm not gonna fight whatever's over there. I don't feel like it. Okay, what we want to look for... oh! It's one of those springs that'll refill all, all your stuff. What we're looking for is a locked jaw. Um, through here maybe? No, this is just treasure and yikes. 
fish bones and a skull. And a crystal. And a destroyed boat. I think the water dragon ate a fisherman. That's unfortunate, I guess. Uh, hey. I got a save point right here if you desire the ability to save your progress at this moment in time. Can I go up here? Up. Oh, I can. I smell secrets. Are there secrets? That's a dead end. What about over? Oh, never mind. Uh, still am gonna come up here. Oh no. Well, I did that a second time, but it's still okay. I don't think there's actually anything up there. Could be wrong, but whatever. Uh, let us destroy this lockjaw. Mm-hmm. Nice knowing you, friend. What's that? It's all tangled up in this flabby stomach muscle. Looks like a glass ball or something. Or an orb, you could say? Yeah? It's a glass ball or something. Wait a sec, I wonder if it's the dragon orb? Bah, it won't budge. That water dragon sure doesn't want to give this thing up. Must be something really important. Like the dragon orb, maybe? This is where I came from. If it is, I'm gonna- Oh, camera angle. All right. This is not where I came from, which is surprising because I seem to accidentally backtrack a lot. <laughs> a dead end? I don't know where we are now, but I don't like the look of that red liquid there. It's probably- it'll- it'd probably digest us in a second if we fell in. Yep, that's a lovely thought, isn't it? I think I'm gonna be sick. Look at that hunk of tissue. Looks like it's keeping a lid on that disgusting liquid. Why don't we break it open? <laughs> Yuck, it's all squishy squashy. Ew! And what's with that bright red liquid that keeps falling from it? Would you stop messing with that furball? You're crushing me out. <laughs> uh, can I? Oh, I can use water sprout. What the heck are you doing? That red liquid is raining down now. What'll happen if that fleshy mass dissolves? Hmm. Now you got me interested too. <laughs> yep. Curiosity killed the wolf. Alright, come on. What the? The whole place is flooded with that icky red li liquid. We came to find the dragon orb, not to end up lunch. Okay, nitro lily pads. Yes, okay, well that will save me. Surely, up. Oh. No, oh, okay. <laughs> I'm glad it just doesn't kill you instantly. That would be really annoying, so thank you developers for just making it slowly drain your health and not an insta-kill, so you had to start all over again. Uh, no, not wind! I don't want to go back! No! Jump away! Okay. I'm glad that... Uh, that it's pretty merciful when drawing lily pad circles, and it's not like drawing rejuvenation circles. This, that would make life a lot more difficult. Okay. I'm glad I have my- oh! I overshot it. My, um... I think it's got a golden ink pot, which makes my ink pots get restored quicker. Okay, we're almost there. Uh, I'm not- No! I've lost one whole solar energy unit. Okay! We made it! And now... Let us dissolve this muscle. No, not blow it away. Okay, we're getting close. It 
was in fact the dragon orb. Nice work, Gami. We finally got that dragon orb. Now we should be able to break the barrier on Oni Island. When Tamika locates the island on her crystal ball, the enemy's stronghold will be totally exposed. Boy, you sure had a hard time pulling that orb out. I wonder if the dragon's gonna be okay. Let's go, Wami. I mean, we got the orb. No use sticking around here. What the heck? Are these the vengeful, vengeful spirits of the people the dragon go gobbled up? No, wait. These aren't spirits. That weird color can only mean one thing. Foxfire. Time to fight a trio of foxes. These guys can be really annoying from what I remember. Well, we'll see how I do. I can already predict a smelly score. That's fine. Just as long as I win, I don't care. Uh, oh yeah, they suck away your ink powers. Uh, that is really annoying! Uh, and it's constantly being sucked away. Okay. Well, I am glad that I have the golden ink pot because that makes when it's when I'm not cursed and it's not being drained it makes it come back a lot faster okay looks like I got one down uh, veil of mist can be helpful get more hits in uh, please die okay you're vulnerable okay I think that one's dead as well now I just gotta take care of this one shouldn't be too hard now it's a fair fight. Uh, yeah, okay. Thank God. I actually did better than I thought I would, all things considered. Okay, never mind. Jeez. Okay, let me use Veil of Miss. Just, just get in a good combo. Thank you. Uh, uh, uh Veil of Miss again. It can be very helpful. Now. You are dead. Okay, I'm feeling a bit better about this phase. And I'm getting into the groove of things. Uh, is that again? All right. Okay, yeah, moving along smoothly. Where's the other one? Is there another one? What? Oh, there it is. Oh, no. They're all back. No. Stop it! Stop this right now! Ah, oh, come on! How many times do I have to kill you guys before you'll stay dead? Ugh. Okay, well... Whatever. At least, at least the curse didn't last- and he's doing it again. And it drains so quickly, too! Ah. Okay, well... Should be over before long. Power slash you, maybe. Have to angle the camera all the way around. Okay. Use my veil of mist again. This one's almost dead. Okay, there's that one. Uh, what is wrong with your head? Oh. <laughs> What's that? Something was going on there. No! You will not drain my ink. Hey, thank you. Alright, give it to me straight. What did I get? Oh! I did way better than I thought I would. Okay. Hey, I'm not complaining.
contained fox rods. What the heck was that? It was kind of freaky. It looked like a bundle of bamboo tubes or something. I know. I bet those are the fox rods that Busty Babe wanted. You know, that ultimate weapon against the Dark Lord. I knew it! You should have tried to pull that orb out more gently. I'm too young to be digested! <laughs> Let's get out of here! Yep, run, run, run. Oh, thank you, very helpful arrow, telling me where to go, even though it's kind of just a straight line, but you know, whatever works. Okay, yeah, run, run, run. You have about three minutes to escape this dragon. <laughs> uh, the shadows of the fluids will tell you where they're gonna fall. Uh, gotta stop and get some treasure. You know, some people stop to smell the roses. I, for one, stop to get the treasure. Okay, please go. This isn't too difficult. I mean, there's the added pressure of the time limit, but you should be able to easily make it out in time unless you linger for some reason, which there's not really much reason to. Yeah, two minutes to spare. Simple, simple. Water dragon. It's dead. Now what are we supposed to do? We have the dragon orb, but no water dragon for it to send to control. No matter how hard Himiko tries to locate Oni Island, without that dragon, there's no way we can break the barrier. Hey, something's coming. <laughs> Madarasu, origin of all that is good and mother to us all. I'm afraid there's no time left for me to speak now. But I do need to thank you. What for? And who are you anyway? I am King Wada. The 27th King of the Dragonians. King of the Dragonian? So then, you were that water dragon? It was I, the water dragon, god of the sea, ruler of the deep. Oh, great god of Madarasu. As you well know, there are ill omens heralding the coming of great strife throughout Nippon. Even the Dragonians have suffered under the forces of darkness. They seek to prevent me from using my power. The power to break the barrier that protects Oni Island. I waged battle against the Dark Lord and consumed the dark instrument he wielded. But the instrument lodged in my stomach and drove me to madness. Instrument of the Dark Lord? You mean this thing? Yes, the Fox Rods. Without the Fox Rods, the Dark Lord has limited power. Now, all of the monsters are doing everything they can to locate them. I see. They're like a key to his power or something. I can rest easy knowing they are in your hands, Amaterasu. I also ask that you give my wife, Orohime, the dragon orb. It is the heart of the dragon. It will bring peace to my people. 
Alas, my end is near. I have slain many innocent while in the grip of madness. I pray that their souls may rest in peace in these watery depths. These deep blue waters the people of Ryoshima Coast so dearly love. Farewell, Amaterasu. I shall pray for your good fortune. Uh, this is kind of a bad time, but his name was Wada, right? So I guess you could say he was the Wada Dragon? <laughs> no? Bad time? Yeah? Okay. Huh? Amaterasu, you made it! Busty babe! I saw the crazed water dragon thrashing about from the shore. So I hurried here to the dragon palace, just in case. Oh, you don't have to worry about us. I mean, nothing could stop old Lama here. Not fire, not water, not... Tell me, Amaterasu. What happened to the water dragon? Did he reveal the secret of penetrating Oni Island? Hey, it's not nice to interrupt. I was on a roll, babe. Anyway, the water dragon was actually the Dragonian King. He turned into to a dragon to protect the drag Dragon Palace. Yeesh. Isun, don't go waving that thing around. He even snatched these fox rods from their boss. You found the fox rods? Come to think of it, weren't you looking for these, babe? Aren't they the ultimate weapon against the evil beings? Hey, wait a sec. What about what you said about the fox rods? You know, about the ship sinking before they reached Himiko? Why'd we search that stupid ship if they weren't really there? If you're still upset that I put you in danger, I'm sorry. But time is of the essence now. Give me the fox rods, quickly. Now, you just hold your melons, babe. Eat soon, please, jeez. I mean, if those monsters are frant frantically searching for them, whoever has them will have a huge bullseye on their back. Amaterasu? I hope you know what you're doing, fur you big furball. It's an eerie light they give out, yet somehow alluring. With this, my holy powers will reach their limit. I can destroy every last demon there is. Protecting Queen Himiko with this great power, that is my duty. Don't worry, Amaterasu. I must hurry back to the city now. I shall honor my duty with my life. With your life? Don't go getting yourself killed, babe. Wow, oh, she's gone. Hey, Yami! Quit spacing out! We gotta deliver that dragon orb we got from the water dragon to Odohime right away! We probably can't count on the power of the water dragon anymore, but the Dragonians still consider the dragon orb as their treasure. We better return it to them. Yep. Indeed. And now... All there is is just a fish bone. Uh, yeah, that probably acted as his grave and everything, but... I'm just gonna disturb it. Yeah. Well, we got the dragon orb. 
and the fox rods. So, two birds, one stone. However, the water dragon, who was actually the king of the Dragonians, had to pay the price. So now, what we gotta do is return the dragon orb to the Dragonians. But, till we do that, I wish you all a farewell.